Today, the Juggernauts will be competing in their first pass or fail challenge. They will both be placed in the darkest and brightest inescapable rooms. Will they be able to escape? That is the question. Welcome to Team Edge, YouTube's first ever Challenge League. Today, we have the Juggernauts trying to escape the most inescapable rooms that we have ever built, ever here on Team Edge. Currently, the Juggernauts are in second place with the Mud Dogs close behind them. It's a pretty dangerous game right now. If the Juggernauts escape both their rooms within the allotted time, they will earn themselves an edge point. Ooh. Hey, let's go, bro. No. Hey, which box do you want? I'll go with the softness of his tongue. I literally felt your fingerprint, bro. That's gross. Brian, you will be in the dark room. Kevin, you will be in the light room. Each of you, when you walk in, need to put a blindfold on and wait to take it off until I say go. You each have 30 minutes to get out. You have three clues between the two of you. So if you want to use a clue, you have to talk to Kevin first because that's taking one of his clues away. There will be a variety, yes, I said it, a variety <laughs> of punishments that I will be handing to you guys just to annoy you. And you have to do them. This is painful, this is just dark. Yeah, I feel like I'm in my mother's womb when I'm in there. What does it feel like when you're in this room? It feels like being on the surface of the sun while pretty hot in there. Somebody's doing this with your eyes. I can see the universe. Close your eyes when you go in there as well. Once I say the word, you guys can take off your B-folds. <laughs> All right, Connor, you guide him in. I'll guide him, Kevin. Okay, my eyes are closed. Okay. <laughs> you guys will go in there. I'm not starting time when you go in there. Once I start time, you can take off your blindfolds, okay? okay. All right, are we going in? Yes, or go in. Oh, yeah. Dude, it is warm in here. I picked the wrong box. There you go. Oh. Come on in, buddy. What's on the ground? Go ahead and go. Dude, What's I just got on? nauseous. How are you feeling, Kevin? I'm feeling warm. I'm feeling pumped. I'm feeling excited. How you doing, Brian? You doing great? You look great. I'm curious why the ground is soft. Before we get started with today's video, I am going to be starting the time. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Before we get started, go buy some merch down in the description below. Buy the merch! <laughs> I am starting the time in five, four, three, two, one. Hey! Oh, oh my goodness. It oh. is dark. Okay. Okay, remember, gentlemen, you're trying to find a code. You guys may be able to see certain things that they can't. The cameras are exposed so that you can see. But Kevin's got a bunch of light flashing in his eyes, so it's really bright for him. It's almost pitch black dark in there for Brian. So you guys may be able to see something that he can't right now. That little light, that, that number two you see on the light panel, he can't see that because that light is on all the way. Oh, I kind of see stuff. I think it's wrong with the carpet. Something's there. All right, so we have, what are these lights too? Or what are these? We have five holes here. Oh, it's way too bright. From our perspective, Kevin looks like an old man. <laughs> he's like this, he's just like, I feel like that's from every perspective. Oh, I saw corn on the floor. <laughs> I see something. Oh, look, Brian found something. Did I just break it? Oh, always oh, rearranging, disengaging. Hey, bro, so I, I don't know, there's like four holes. They look like lights. Yo, I don't see anything, Brian. What? I don't see any clues here. Oh, wait. Hey, one of these lights has a number two on it, bro. Oh, he found the number two. Oh. Who did? I did? Wait, I found the number two? No. No, I found number two. <laughs> what? <laughs> I was so confused. Oh, wait, I see another number, but I can't quite make it out. He's going through this quick. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think that goes here. I see something here. I don't know if it's a five. <laughs> I, hey, this part here is, is, is matte. It's not shiny like the other one. What number is it? I hate escape rooms! Oh, bro, I think I found a three. Is this a three? I cannot confirm or deny. It's a five. I got, hey, I got a number. What'd you find, Brian? I found a five. Where'd you find the five, Brian? It was on this wall. Ah! <laughs> I love snacks. So, there's a hole right here. Look. Okay. Right, you go in here and you open this up, okay? And then you start punching them, okay? What's happening? What's happening? What is that? Oh my God. What's happening? Oh, hi, so we can't see you. Oh my eye, bro. Ow, you hit my eye. Oh, he stole it from me. 
I had a feeling he would do that. I cannot see here, it's too bright. Oh, it's too bright. I'm getting a headache, Brian. I'm getting a headache. Ooh. Oh, you scared me. Hey, I found another number. What, which one? Three. I have a two and a three too. How many do you have? Two. Oh. <laughs> Stop it. These escape rooms are dumb. Why would anybody go pay to go to an escape room? Brian's terrible at these things. Three, two, one. Ow! Hey! Oh, that hurt the eyes! I gotta adjust! No! Hey, strobe it, Connor! I, great, I can't see now. Hey, Kevin! What? Are you stuck? Yeah, I only found two numbers. You wanna use a clue? I might need to for sure. Use it! Hey, can I get a clue? Which side wants to use a clue? Brian, do you need a clue? What the heck is this? Ah! You can't give me a clue to one I already found. Reach for the stars. I, I've been reaching for the stars. I've been reaching for the, what kind of clue is that? Reach. Well, not, not in that sense. Grab them. So, five and four. Ah! <laughs> oh. Bro, I can't see when you do that. <laughs> Why do you think I I'm think that's it? the point of it. <laughs> Ow, my. Why are you Bro. reaching up there, Brian? Because there's a hole. Um, Kevin has said nine. He wants to know if we can confirm or deny. Are, are you, can you confirm? We, we can neither right? confirm, confirm or deny. Or deny. <laughs> All right, Kevin, here's a punishment for you. You haven't gotten any yet. Oh. <laughs> you have to wear <laughs> this. <laughs> what is this? You must wear it. What is this? No excuses, bro. No excuses. I can't even see it. <laughs> what the heck is How you do wearing? You, okay, I feel like this thing, I'm, it's like my helicopter right here. Spin. Oh, I cannot turn. Hey, Brian. What? I have three numbers. I have two, three, and nine. I need one more. I hate these. Brian, how many do you have? I have two, but I think I'm stuck. Brian, what numbers do you have? I have five, three, and I think eight. I don't know if this is supposed to be a number or not. So here's how this game works. This is for the dark room. These were on the wall of Brian's room. He had to rearrange those to make a number five. There's a rug on the ground in his room that has the letter three uh, uh, cut out of it. Uh, and he doesn't know that, uh, like that. Uh, and then this, wow, it's wow, brown. Wow. Get get out of here! <laughs> Him with a stupid hat on. This is braille for two. And then at the end, we're gonna knock nine times. Morse code. Bro, this is, <laughs> look at him pawing around in there. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Wait, so we each have one more clue, right? So I have three numbers, I can get one more clue, Brian. But then I only got one clue to use. Do you guys want another clue? What numbers do you have? I have two, three, and nine. Nine, three, and two. How many hints have you taken? One. Okay, then you have two more. So do you want Brian to have a hint? All right, give me a, hey, I want to use a clue. Okay, Brian, are you ready for your clue? Yes. Wait, which numbers do you have? Five, three. Senses, touch, and feel. Blind people do this to read. Braille. Braille, Brian. I don't see any, Ow. do you feel any braille? Of course you don't see You don't anything. see anything, can you feel braille? So touch everything, do you feel like little, little bumps, little dots? I've been touching everything. Do not, you yeah, don't do me dirty like that, bro. <laughs> Put this dog collar on with tin foil in it. Actually, that might help him. Oh, no. <laughs> Bro. Oh. <laughs> oh, these are two. You got it? Two. Two. Hello. Brian, that was a clue, Brian. Come on in. He gave you a clue with the knocks. What does that mean? Did you not hear how many knocks it was, bro? He's too dumb to figure it out. <laughs> He's been knocking the whole time. Bro, it's been a consistent time twice. <laughs> Nine. So you have how many, you have four? No, I have three numbers. They gave you two clues, how do you only have three numbers? They didn't give me two clues. You're dumb. No, I'm not saying anything else. Bro, you course. dumb, they gave you a braille code and the knock code. I didn't ask for the second code, for the second hint. Well figure out the braille. Hey, don't yell at me. I don't feel anything. I don't like escape rooms. I don't get, it. what are these? <laughs> He's so mad. Bye, <laughs>
Guys, if I miss this shot, you have to subscribe. Oops. OK, Kevin, you can get rid of that now. Kevin! What? You just have one left? I have one left. Well, do you want to use the last clue? Oh! <laughs> Is they have one more clue. They left. only have one more clue. Do you want the clue? Or do they want the clue? What do you mean? Brian already got four. Brian, you got two clues already, bro. I got one! No, they gave you the braille. Remember what they said? That what blind people need to... What they... To the thief. That and the knocking. You got the knocking, which is nine. So your numbers are what now? I got five, three, nine. Okay. Now the fourth one, you got to use the braille clue. The braille code was for the three? No. I already had guessed three. What? <laughs> What are you talking you about? You're breaking my mind right now. This is why Brian can't do Brian, escape rooms. Brian, Brian, <laughs> for a total of all of your numbers, you have said four different numbers. No, but you cannot five. remember in. Ow, my toe! The numbers I said were five, three, and nine. Oh, this is two. No, you said that. You okay, said that even, another oh number. Oh my gosh. That, hey, we can't give it to him. Brian. <laughs> He's just forgetting. Oh, the eight. <laughs> oh my goodness. Brian. Oh my goodness. I don't know, bro. This is stupid. I can't breathe. Joey. What? I think that's where the confusion is. I already knew the three on the ground on the carpet. That's not where the confusion is. Yeah, trust me. That's not the confusion. But we still have one more clue. I know, and you said it already. Brian, I think you said two a long time ago. Bro, why are you yelling at me? Yell at them! Because you dumb! <laughs> okay, so it's two then. Hey, he, he, he's with us. We've given you everything. All right, I'm, put, I'm starting to, my code combinations here. What's our time at? You have seven minutes and 30 seconds left. Three, five, nine, two. Yeah! Hey! Hey, get me out of here! Access granted! I'm out, bro! Ow, my finger! Am I busting out? <laughs> Wait, can I get out? Is he allowed to come Did out? Did it say access granted? Yes! Then you're out. Yes! Hey! Oh, everything is so bright. Hey, escape rooms are by far the dumbest things you could ever do with your free time. You need to go back to elementary school, bro. <laughs> Why? I said both of those numbers. It was either eight or two. I said, I said both of those numbers. You guys said, no, that's not it. Hey, run that back. Oh, these are two. Oh, what is this? It's something to do with this light. Okay, turned off once, twice, three times, four times, five. Five? I think it was five! He's had every single number. What number? What, what numbers has he gotten? All of them. He's gotten all the numbers. Bro, what are you doing? Start entering the numbers! Bro, I've only confirmed three! Say the numbers you know for sure. Two? Wait, he's, they're lighting me again. Two. One, two, three, four. Five? I think it's five. Okay, go for it. Start entering so numbers. So I, I have two, I have a number three, I have nine, and I think it's a five, bro. Okay, go with that. Start from the lowest number, go two, and then enter the number. Kevin has four minutes left. So, okay, so two, what's my lowest number? Two, three, five, nine. X is right! First try. Yeah, bro! Hey, get out! Hey, you have to hit the number. Hit the button. Is hit that the, your first the try? You got it on the first try. Yes! <laughs> yeah, bro! Wow. With three, Woo! With 345 to spare. Hey, wow. that was you got too it on your first close. try? Yeah, I got it on my first try. Wow. Dude, Good hey, job. That was too close. I thought, nah, we'll get out of here in like 10 minutes. My eyes hurt. Juggernauts, since you completed your pass or fail challenge, you have been awarded an edge point. Good job, Pass. Hey. Try passing that. Ah! Hey. Hey, yeah. Hammerheads. What's up, Hammerheads? What's up, <laughs> Hammerheads? Right here, right here, Hammerheads. Well, Bobby's holding the camera in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you go check out our previous video right over there. That is Escape the Room with 100 mystery buttons and only one button lets you escape. That was kind of crazy. Also, make sure you go check out that video down there. That's our next video where the Sentinels had to find me, hidden somewhere in the edge space. It was kind of crazy because our hiding space was rather ingenious. So make sure you check that out and subscribe to our channel. Peace. Get your Juggernaut merch, baby!